Sweet and Savory is being replaced with Creepy and Crawly. MTN's Jane McDonald tells us what's for breakfast at Montana State University. Bobcats and bugs. It may seem like an unlikely pairing, but the annual bug buffet is coming back for its 34th year. Oh yeah, you're right. We're gonna I'm need some that. Bugs are our future. They're gonna help us uh, feed the world. Turn on the burner, get your ingredients prepped, and pour in some crickets. The surprise after they've eaten it and they realize it tastes good. An event that started with a pound of butter, bugs in a single classroom has now grown into a week-long showcase of possibilities. That's good. <laughs> We're never going to want to stop eating steaks or, you know, pork chops, chicken and stuff. I just think that it's important that people um, are willing to broaden their scopes, try new things, because, I mean, you never know what you're going to like. And this year, the buffet is standing out, blending the history of Montana with the menu. This year, we're looking at uh, edible insects that have been used almost in an industrial scale size in the Great Basin, which is very near the edge of Montana, by Native Americans. And an MSU alumni turned her passion into a business. Reaching these people and these college students can help them to incite a food systems revolution quite easily. They're very versatile, that's one thing. Not all foods or protein-based foods can uh, be served in so many different ways, but bugs can. The menu will feature different dishes like salads, cookies, and more. The event will kick off on Monday the 28th, and a common theme for the event is education and a little confidence. Kind of putting yourself out there, being brave about little things like that really kind of pays off. Teaching people about doing this, opening their eyes to you know, new um, possibilities, new cultures and such. In Bozeman, Jade McDonald, MTN News.